Okay, welcome back to Dwarf Fortress. Okay, we have a named troglodyte in here. That's the guy that probably killed one or two of our other guys. Let's see, where, um, how many of these monster slayers I got still? Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them, I guess. Let's go to this one. I don't know where they all are. I mean, when they're just trying to sleep and do different things uh let's see here actually i'm gonna need to zoom in a little bit my eyeballs are just waking up in the morning here okay looks like they're finally making food in the, the kitchen that's a good thing because these guys are probably eating a lot of food having all these guys around i really really want to make my money off the of craft stuff but uh I guess we're gonna have to do that. We'll just, I'm not gonna go too crazy with it though. All right, let's see here. Still, uh, plants on repeat, fruit on repeat. Okay, we'll do a bunch of those. I'm just queuing up some work because I got to do some things here down below. Bunch of barrels. Continue with the blocks. Well. Yeah, I guess. All right, let's see. D, D, let's reclaim. Uh, well, it's like we got enough stuff here anyway. All right. Um, let's dump. Let's do a dump order on whatever's remaining. Like some of this stuff that's just sort of laying around. All right, so, oops, one more piece up here. All right, so what do we got? Let's do a dump order on all this stuff. This way you can get it in. Right behind our behind the, the, the gate in case we close ourselves down or something like that. Eventually I'm gonna do a dump order on this wood. So as you see here, here's the problem. A lot of our guys are are going down there into the cave system and I don't want them to. Now it looks to me, it looks like they did kill some troglodytes. I think these smaller T's are the one. One, two, three. That might be the Gorlack. That was the troll. That's the one guy. So our corpse stockpile is completely filled up. And I I don't know if I want to add more, but I'm <laughs> for temporarily, yeah. Let's just get all this rest of this stuff out of here. For right now, I guess we're going to leave it open, but I kind of want to get, I kind of want to close this off. I, I think this is too dangerous. We're getting, we're getting a lot of problems from this in other words so i know it's gonna be fun but <laughs> i don't really know i mean like a, a forgotten beast that comes in right now would completely wipe us out so, so there's a dead troglodyte that t that's right, see right here uh so we got another one right there a bunch of stuff right here looks like we took out a bunch of those yeah troglodyte parts Urclose, something's lower tooth, which is probably a named troglodyte. Two more troglodytes. Parts of their bodies. So that looks like a cobalt uh, graphic, but I don't know. I think those are troglodytes. So I think we have a lot of things. What does TSK mean? I think that means they're coming to pick it up, but I don't know. I don't remember what that even means. Acorn flies. Only hu injured humans. Yeah, just different parts of dudes. And another dead troglodyte there and here. And another one there. There's more parts here. Holy crap, we chopped off a lot of arms and legs. Another one there. Look at that, like over here on this cliff. Parts of them got chopped down. I guess I'm just looking for all the parts. Yeah, we still got stuff from this. There's another guy that we got struck down over here. And that bronze helm, I think that was part from... This is where the that giant cave spider was. Okay, so let's get back up to the surface. Alright, so... Hmm, do I want to close off one of these entrances? Yeah, I think I do. I think I want to make sure... Build, see, floor. Temporarily, we're going to close this one off. Use obsidian block. And I want our guys to be able to get the rest of the stuff down there. So we're going to leave 
Let's see, where is the entrance I made? Okay, so those red, green, black birds are still causing problems. All right, so we made it so we're going to have a door here with some traps, cage traps. So we're, I think I'm going to do is close this off. At some point, I'm just waiting for them, our people to get done here. I know I could forbid this and just do that now, but let's just, we might as well grab up what we can. I want to get the corpses out of there and probably bury them at some point. All right, so do we have anything else to actually do here? Because I think we closed ourselves off from the cave system other than that entrance. Looks like it. Yeah, because we, we walled off all this stuff properly. So what do we have? To, we have to start working on the outdoor walls. The merchants are here. They're going to be leaving soon, I think. Um, yeah, it's probably why some of the, some of them are over here. But those those red winged blackbirds have been here for a while now. They gotta they gotta get rid of them. Looks like probably some scattered bolts that their dwarf their dwarf guards probably shot at them. Uh, let's see, D, B, yeah, let's do a reclaim on those. Come on, get that floor up, guys. They don't got it on there yet. I mean, that's good that they're getting all the stuff out of there. I don't know why we have a chicken going down there. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Huh? Why is the chicken going down there? Why? Whose chicken is that? Is that ours? He's a named rooster, someone's pet. So he's following one of his master around. All right, let's just take a look here. Till just this, still just this one troglodyte. A lot of deceased ones. One was named because he probably killed one of the people. So three people, one from, I think, uh, yeah, one of them was from the cave giant case bar and two more from troglodyte, okay. Now, I think also I made a wood stockpile, didn't I? I got to start getting stuff below ground, like everything, and start walling us off. Yeah, we're, we're running out of room here. Oops, dump. Let's just at least dump the crap out of the wood stockpile so we can get our maximum amount in there. In the future, though, yeah, we're already out of, like, armor spots here. See, this whole thing was that armor one that we set up for a temporary thing. We are going to have them move all this stuff. Is this a wood one? No, this was a arrow one, I mean. Yeah, it was. Furniture, probably. One was probably food, and one was probably something else. I just, I, I, I'm, I got this OCD thing. I got to get rid of all this stuff. That level is complete. Now, I think our miners are done, right? Yeah, because now they're getting so good that... Okay, so these, okay, let's see, we go, we go, this is our main entry level. Did I hook up this? I think I hooked up the main outer door to this, this thing here. So as soon as that floor is done, I think we should be all right. We'll be protected from an outdoor siege if it should come. Or some outdoor monster, if we have time to react. So now this is the this is the challenge with this, with it being a smaller map. We have way less time to react to a siege or some creature coming in. See, look, troglodyte, right there. He will. He left. That's the name troglodyte. Where is he going? He walked off the map. Good. I mean, well, good in a way, I guess. All right, so I don't see anything else in the cave system. Oh, there is a now there's a giant rat. That'll probably cause cancellations. Maybe those dwarves will come after it. I don't know. All right, so what? We got guys that construct, but are they just prioritizing hauling? Why are they not constructing this now? All right, well, I'm, I'm getting distracted. I really need to get my... Uh, why? Okay, so look. Like, some of the caravan guys are leaving. Why aren't these guys leaving? Well, now they stopped leaving, so they're just sort of wandering around here. 
No, I'm getting distracted. I need to I need to get these miners back to work. And we start I want to start planning out what we're doing for the rest of this fort here. So yeah, that's that's the thing. That's the thing, you know. Alright, so Yeah, because right now this is just a freaking mess, right? This is just a mess. I think we need to do one more one more layer for like storage and stuff. I don't know. I know I'm doing each level different with different pillars and different spots, but yeah, I'm just I'm just doing that. Sorry. That way I can differentiate a little bit. We actually don't have that many levels, do we? Before I hit that cave system, I actually have to start building what I was going to do out here. So I might as well show you. I'm going to do it on this level first because we we want to reclaim some levels here. We need to do that essentially. Then we're going to build floors over everything, and then pull the walls along this, these edges. So we got our miners doing that. Wait a minute. Do I want before I do this? Uh, I want to make some pillars here. Yeah. Make it a little different. A little different, man. Yeah. There you go, my bros. <clears throat> well, these giant black bird, birds or whatever the hell they are, they're causing tons of cancellations. Tons of them. I mean, really, they're, they're, they're causing problems with the dude. See, look, they, our guys just keep dropping the corpses and stuff <laughs> over here. All right, look, can you guys get this stuff and get it done? See, apparently these things want to cause problems. Okay, now I saw a buzzard. So, oh, now I got buzzards and the giant. Wow. Uh, we really need to maybe get someone buried, too. Get people buried. Okay, so he thought twice about grabbing the corpse. He's running around now. See, did you see him? <laughs> That's our guy. <laughs> yeah, this guy here. Inaccessible. Good. All right, so they closed that finally. All right. That was probably the guy that did it, too. That's probably another reason why it took so long. It was those stupid birds out there. Scumbags. All right. Oh, one thing we need. We're probably going to need some more mechanisms, right? I don't know. We're going to do those cage traps below ground. I know that. Uh, Carpenter, why aren't you working? You probably finished all the barrels, right? Yep. Okay. Do some bins. Knock yourself out, bro. All right. Now... See, I really can't lay out a level and do a level as its final form until I kind of get everything cleared out of there. I just, I don't know why. I just can't really do it. So who else doesn't have a job? See, these guys are just random haulers. They should be hauling that stone that I designated for moving. Yeah, all this. Why are they not moving it? Must be someone people must be moving it because we have more in there. That's good. And there's more in this level that's got to get moved. Okay. So what else is in the cave system? All right. Well, just the rat. I guess finally the merchants are leaving. That's the giant rat right there. Now what I don't get is why why these all these monster hunters are here. Why not just kill him? Look, he he was he's right there. There's no interest in fighting the giant rat. None. All right, we need to take a quick look down here to see if they cleared up all this crap. Because it was up in this area, right? It looks like yeah. What is this guy? What is he doing? Okay, we have a peasant here. It's just sitting here. Why are you just sitting there? No job. Yeah, I get that, but why um, sit in the cave system there? That's not good. That's... Wait a minute. These are the guys... They're not able to path in? The guys that say they have no jobs, the glassmaker one... And this peasant down here, they're just sitting there as if they can't path in. 
Well, there's a path right there. Oh, wait a minute. That's not cut to the fort. Damn it. All right, look. I, I think I got to deconstruct that. Otherwise, our guys will die. Or I got to connect it from the inside again. All right, all right. I, I closed that up, too. I kept thinking I had another fort, an entrance to the fort on the inside still. Which would have been risky anyway, but... All right, so... Uh, I guess we'll rescue our guys here. Looks like that's it's blinking. People are coming. We reclaim. No, reclaim C. Another thing that is they're not going to reclaim stuff on the surface. Unless I do... Orders. Refuse R. Worth... Ignore refuse from outside. Oh. They'll grab stuff from outside. They won't actually pick up those arrows that are scattered all over. I know I keep getting this guy entering a martial trance. Another troglodyte. Alright. Two troglodytes are now there. Well, this is going to be a problem because they're causing more problems because these guys tend to go after the troglodytes. One's dead. You see that? You see that? He just went, wah! Get that one. Get get him. Why are you stopping running after this guy? See, he's right there. That's a truck light, and that's our guy. Okay? Make a beeline to him. Truck light's right there. You know, these guys aren't, aren't very brave monster slayers. I don't know what their problem is. One troglodyte now. <laughs> now there's liaison. Why is he still here? Is he trying to have a meeting? Yeah, maybe, but I don't really see him uh, having meetings here. So he had his meeting, so he's just hanging out now. Oh, what happened? Did they kill him? I see dead troglodytes there. So uh, let's check out for. Yes, they opened it up. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. He's injured, it looks like, huh? Uh, v? Is it V that you go over? W. No, he's just hungry and thirsty. That's why he's flashing. All right. Yeah, the corpse stockpiles once again all filled up. And winter is upon us. Let's pause here. Okay, we are back. Bam. Unpause. Man, it's mostly like, like, uh... Just have one troglodyte down there. Buzzards are now flying around causing problems. Zoom to that troglodyte, please. And planters with no jobs, which actually is a good thing. The problem means our our, uh, our guys are kind of caught up with uh, farming. Spearman found dead. How tragic. <laughs> oh me, oh my. Uh, oh, thief, protect the horde. Wait, go back to that. Ah. Ah. Announcements. Z. All right, now, first off, why would you... Okay, like, you're going to, trying to go to cavern system. Maybe it's trying to pick up some of the stuff we've dropped. That's fine. I'm not too worried about that. Goodbye, Mr. Cobalt. He just ran off. He got chased off. This will be darn monster hunters here. There he is. And all his infinite glory, Mr. Cobalt. And he runs off the screen. Unrotten. Okay, that's... I think that announcement was just that we finished up our food that we have. So what is this one? Troglodyte. See, that's that's a problem. That means civilians are encountering this troglodyte now. Zoom to location. All the way over here? Maybe they're just sensing them through the wall here. But that's pretty far away. Why would... We, well, I guess we do have some guts and stuff over here from one of the dead troglodytes. They're probably trying to haul the, these parts up. Right now, this is the level we need to work on here. Mm. Yeah, let's just start this off floor. Now, we need to leave a wall space. So, let's see here. The wall will be right here, so I'll just make this one big giant floor. Obsidian blocks. 27. Thankfully, we probably have them all. Gives our guys something to do anyway. 
I kind of need to reclaim these floors. I guess so. I guess these early floors just be like open layouts for right now. It won't be doing the, the. Well, I guess we could turn one of them into a dining hall. I don't know. We'll wait. We'll do that in a few minutes. All right. What is that about? Cannot reach construction site. Oh, they're probably trying to reach over here. Cage trap. Why can't you reach that? No, that's down there. That's how can you not reach that? Why can you not reach this? So these are the only cage traps set up, right? That's uh, that's pathable in and out of the fortress. So what's the problem here? All right, I don't understand that. Um, unless that was just suspended because of buzzards flying around. The troglodytes in there and it's causing a problem. All right, let's just check out what is this troglodyte. Now there's two troglodytes now. All right, he's frightened. He's down here. This one. See, they're, they're still, those two are still in the cave system, so I'm not really sure what the problem is. But I'm getting cancellations. Huh. And the red-winged blackbirds are back. Very well. Looks like we can probably add more flooring here. I don't understand what this. this this, I don't know, am I missing something with this cage trap thing that's saying they can't, they can't, uh, path to it? I just don't get that. And hey, let's just get the wall going here. There you go. That gives them some work to do. So wall off that. Wall off this. The miner should be able to reach this place now. So then we'll have to reclaim this level. See, I'm getting annoyed with these these things underground here. I might just block ourselves off. But the thing is, if if, if they if for some reason they can't path there, what? Why not? I just don't see an obstruction here. Yeah. See, look, they got one of the cage traps done. Okay, another guy found dead, which probably means some of these troglodytes. So now it's three troglodytes. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of problems with these troglodytes. What the freaking heck, man? Yeah, this is not good. It's just—it's causing too much problems by having this open. Probably one of the troglodyte dead corpses are causing us the asthma down there, right? You can see our dwarves are. Or some of these uh, petitions are swarming in there, charging down on a, trying to get the troglodytes. I'm sure this is helping them. Yeah, there's one of the troglodytes. This one up there. It came back down. So things are happening. Lots of fights with these troglodytes. Lots of them. All right, let's see. We gotta finish this level here. All right, all right. Enough, enough distractions. Enough distractions. All right, let's get this wall done. And I canceled some of the floors, but I'm assuming from these cancellations and stuff. Okay. <sighs> Thankfully, we haven't had anything that's able to fly in the cavern system, so we're kind of secure right here. Um. I just trying to get all the rest of the floors designated for this level, if I possibly can. So I'm sorry I'm not yakking it up right this second, but um, that's why. Alright, look, we'll let them go. We just have to do a few more things on the corner. We also have to unsuspend. There's a couple spots here. There was one over here, yeah. Alright, that should unsuspend those. So they're swarming down there doing that. So I'll have some floors here and the wall here and a wall here. Then this level will be sort of secure-ish. Yeah, we're getting a lot of interruptions. I don't get why we're getting interrupted by the troglodytes if they're still in the cave system. It's just maybe they're their proximity. Because they're just a few Z levels below or above us on the outside. I, they must, we must see them or something. So, so eventually we'll get them all, but it's just like we're going to get some cancellations apparently. S, S, and S. 
see floor. Let's get these last couple right down here. A few. I'm hoping that'll clear up this stuff. Because I got more Z levels to do. And obviously we're going to be exposed to the cavern system on some of these levels. Troglodytes could path in. Okay, why? More troglodyte crap. Get that one, please. And the wall here. Ah, I didn't escape too many times. Unpause. Jeez, come on. Just get these two, would you? Okay, okay, come on, get around the last two. Also, we gotta deconstruct this one wall that was here. I don't know how I might have to floor over that if there's an empty space below it. Right here. Then we're pretty much finished this level. Come on. Let us see. Alright, good. There's something below it. That's good. Alright, so that level is now complete. Um, the dump. I might move our dump stockpile below. Maybe make... Yeah, let's see. DB. Let's do a reclaim on what we got. Let's go. This is going to be, in other words, this is, I'm going to make this like our construction level now. I'm going to move a lot of those, a lot of those um, buildings down here, or workshops down here. We're also going to move our garbage stockpile down here, which will be right here. Garbage dump D, right? We're going to remove that garbage dump I, X. Remove that one. Okay, we got, I think, everything. Dump this one last piece here. Another thing we forgot to do. Um, build T and L lever. We need a lever for the master lever for securing us from that cave system. I built a bridge right here. So I want to get that done. Still reclaim on these arrows once more on the entire map. There, just to make sure. Oh, I forgot there's a hill here. There could be some arrows up here. Looks like there were a couple. Alright, so... Alright, so we reclaimed all that. We're secure here. The farms are going. Fortunately, as you see here, all this ammo is going in this stockpile, which i probably going to cause things not to be put in the places they're supposed to be put in. Galena, why is that just sitting there? Dump. Please, get rid of that. Q. All right, not on repeat. Carpenter Workshop X, remove that. Mechanic Shop X, Butcher Shop. I'll leave it, leave it for now. Kitchen, Craft Dwarf Shop X, Kitchen. We'll let this still go for a little bit. We're probably running out of room. Yeah, I don't. We need some more tables and chairs. We need to actually make real bedrooms, a real dormitory, and a real eating area for like an actual real meeting hall. Okay, okay. So this looks like looks like we're getting everything done here. Good. Ammo Z. Throw that outdoor ammo. It's at least temporarily. A stray cat has been stung by a honeybee. No. All right, now our guys might not have much, not much to do, so we're gonna clear this level. Hauling stone. Miner's got no work. Wood carpenter, wood shop carpenter, mason. All right, we want to start building those down here. All right, build workshop. We need the mason shop. Well, we're gonna have the stone on this pillar here, so let's put it right there. Um, Mechanic shop, I guess could be right here, right? What else do we need? 
carpenter shop. That right here. And the craft dwarf workshop. Right there. What else? I guess right now, not much else. How about a tanner workshop? We did slaughter some animals. I have like everyone's designated for tanning. Do tanner there. Mmm. Jewel crafter. I thought I had a jewel crafter come in, but I'm not sure. We'll do that here. We'll do the kitchen. Temporarily the kitchen's gonna be in here, but I'm gonna have a, another area later on. And we'll make another still. Right now. It's not really a major big deal I make it, but I'll make it anyway there. I think that's all the ones I need for right now. Clothier. I do have a clothier guy I think that came in. Okay. No, we're not going to make the clothier yet. Okay. Yeah, the red-winged blackbirds are back. We got a lot of troglodytes now. And there's a lot of them dying. I think some of our guys that we had petitions for have died too, though. Look, there are a lot fewer of our guys. One, two, three, four, five uh, monster slayers now. And it looks like this one got named because probably struck down one of our one of ours. Okay, so that's cool. And the miners need to get going here, though. Need to give them some work. Oh, and I also need to deconstruct that floor there, I think. Or that wall. Let's take a look at the surface here. Oh, we do get frozen. Okay, so it does freeze in the winter here. I was kind of wondering about that. Well, I want to make like an outdoor, like a wall around our base here. So maybe give us a little extra time. Plus we have a storage bin out here, which means there's probably something in it that I don't have a storage for yet. Actually, well, I'm looking at my time here. I'm, I'm like way over on time. I think we're going to have to start working on the wall next time. I might just eliminate the refuse and cor corpse stockpiles because um, it's causing too many people to go, go path all the way out here, then all the way down to the cave system. We're already getting frame rate problems. You see we're already into the 80s on the frame rate problems. Just having the cavern, cavern system open is not good. Plus tons of troglodyte stuff. That's yeah, that's not really helping our situation here. Okay, so we got one cage trap set up. Those three were suspended. That door is there. It hasn't been broken yet, to my understanding. And as you see there, we got guys going in here. A lot of guys. We have no hospital set up. That's another thing we probably should set up for some of these guys. Yeah, there's a troglodyte right there. It's like attached to a wall like Spider-Man. There's another one attached to a wall like Spider-Man. And there's another one and another one. Holy crap, one there, one there, and there's like one of our guys. He's attacking... He's going to get gang, ganged up on here. Come on. Ooh, he's injured now. Take him out, dude. Take him out before you die. <laughs> he didn't He didn't take him out. Took out two. Probably injured another one. I don't know. I'm not going to look at the, the reports on these, but... Uh, yeah, I'm seriously thinking just let's remove this, this door and then just bar ourselves in. Yeah. They're dead now, too. Everyone's dead. This is not good. Not good at all. Well, we're going to start the process of walling ourselves in from the cavern system because the pathing is just... The pathing is, is detecting all these different pathing options when, you're, when each individual dwarf is... See, now they're all swarming in there to pick up parts. That's not good. I don't want that. It's because the, we run the possibility of trapping someone in there, too. That's another thing. I'll wait for these cage traps to get done. It looks like they're getting worked on. They need to get their cages loaded. So we're gonna get, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a couple seconds here to 
See, the troglodyte's already making a beeline towards this stuff. Yeah, it's not good. One named troglodyte is probably the one that killed that one guy a little while ago. Still keep bringing up the, the bodies, though. That's weird. I thought we were completely out of room in there. Alright, I know I'm going way over time here. I, I shouldn't be doing this. I should be saving this the next time. It should be! I had a little extra time to record today. That's why I'm going over, but over time. I kind of want them to... I want to see them get done. Look, these dudes that are just, like... Visiting and stuff, that's... I'm not going to bother with... Uh, should I... See, this guy's going to ask for a petition too soon. Watch. I'm not going to even bother with them. No more petitions, and I'm going to shut this off. I don't like our cats going in there either. What's nothing I can do about that? Oh, yeah, actually, there is a way. It's something I can do about that. Temporarily. Temporarily, let's make a zone for cats. Oh, apparently, we got kittens already. When did that happen? You bet. You stinking scum. <laughs> We're gonna start making some cat burgers here soon. All right. Sorry, I see civilians are still. I still, you know, I still see civilians going down here. So that's a problem. And lots of cancellations from the troglodytes. See, they're they're picking up stuff from the corpses. Swarming in, swarming out. Yeah, this is it. This was a mistake. See, if I, there is a way to fix this if you mess around with burrows. If you have everyone in a burrow and they're only inside the base, and that way that keeps them from pathing into there, and you just, you would have to, every time something fell or dropped, you'd have to basically um, forbid it. And I could forbid the stuff in there now, but I really don't want to. I sort of just want this to kind of naturally play itself out here. And then I'm going to remove this door and then put the wall up right there. I just saw the petitions thing. I don't see the point in allowing them in. I know we're losing guys, though, but... Yeah, we're down to four now. Uh, should I do this? Eradicating monsters. All right, fine. But you're gonna probably going to get trapped in the cavern system, so... Too bad for you. Need cage trap. All right, well, I guess I can't load those. I thought I made like four cage traps. What the hell's up with that? All right, this is getting annoying. All right, from this level down, D, B, forbid, F, on the entire freaking map. Going down to the bottom, bottom, bottom here. Let's see. Bam. All right. Unpause that. Now, even though, yes, we do have a body of one of the guys right here for burial. That's that's it. Okay, so I'm finally going to get this closed off. Theoretically. Remove that door. At least, yeah, did I, I did that right. Forbidden. No, no, reclaim. We don't want the door. Actually, we want all these reclaimed. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking. Yeah, these monster hunters are just going to get trapped in the, in the cavern system. I don't give a crap. All right, so once the door gets done, build a wall here. Well, if you grab the door, maybe they'll grab the door. I got tons of idlers too. I'm not, I'm not paying attention to stuff here. All right, look, come on, come on, hurry, hurry. I got stuff. I gotta end this episode. All right, build, see, wall. Just use the nearby gabbro, and that'll be it. We'll be sealed in. I think we will. Yay, we are officially sealed in. I'm going to actually build another wall here, just in case uh, the, the roof is not 
in the right spot, but that's it. All right. All right. I will see you guys next time. I'm way over time here. I'll pause. I'm oh, another human. Eh. You can't get in now. I'm not going to take its petition. Nope. Too bad. I'm sure he got some trapped in there. I'll see you guys next time. Adios, folks.